If immersion and authenticity are your thing, then you will want to drive sequential transmission cars also in AMS2 that way. It was only a, a couple of days ago until I found out how to make my Fanatec shifter work like that. Here I show you how to do it. The logical way would be to edit your existing user control preset and map gear up and gear down on your shifter accordingly, wouldn't it? Although AMS2 accepts the mapping, in-game this happens. Yep, nothing. Instead, the pedals on the wheel are still active, although they are no longer assigned in the preset. Beats me. But do not despair, because here is the solution. There are two recommended ways in my opinion. The obvious and easiest way is by switching the option Map Sequential Shifter to Shifter Pedals to ON in your Fanatec driver. Just tick the slider and your sequential shifter will do the same as your wheel pedals. But for those who do not like to change their Fanatec driver settings all the time, there is another way in-game. Create a new user control preset. Do not choose your actual manufacturer, but instead select custom. Pro tip, to avoid having to make all assignments again, just copy them from your favorite existing preset. Then select custom as make again, if necessary switch your pedal type, and then under edit assignments, assign gear up and gear down to your sequential shifter as you would and should anyway. That's it. If everything worked, you should now be able to do this. Try it out and have fun with your sequential shifter in AMS2. Thanks for watching and see you on the next one. Oh, uh, just one more thing. Um, please check if the like and subscribe buttons are still working. Thanks.